A portion of this video is sponsored by Bluehost. More on them later. Kickstarter is full of scams. Allegedly. I mean, look at these real useful products. You've got a, a laser razor. You've got a coolest cooler. You've got um, a whatever the f this thing is. This air umbrella shelters you from the rain using a powerful stream of air. No, seriously, what the hell is this? It, it's a CAD model of a stick? How did 825 people fall for this? What is this guy doing? He's, he's zip tying a stick onto another stick? Nothing is going on. What is this montage? No, you the don't talk, I am talking right now. Is currently in the stage of research and development. Research D's nuts. There are 566 comments on this campaign and I'm seeing a lot of them from one guy named Michael Superbacker. 238 of them are Michael Superbacker. That means on average, he has left a comment here every 10 days asking where his air umbrella is for the last seven years. This is Michael's very first comment from 2014. Congratulations, Air Umbrella. I was the last 825th backer. Maybe we'll get an extra present slash reward? Smiley face. This would be the last smiley face Michael ever commented on this page. A few months go by and Michael starts having doubts. It said a December delivery. It's January 9th and I haven't received my umbrella yet. Are they already sent out? No, Michael. No, they're not. You fell for a Kickstarter scam. Allegedly. Another year of silence passes and Michael Superbacker loses his mind. Where the fuck is my money? Where the fuck is my umbrella motherfuckers? <laughs> would be a perfect one-liner for an action movie. I don't know what context it would make sense in, but it, it's, it's, it's perfect. Where the fuck is my umbrella motherfucker? Two years pass. At this point, Michael is pretty much the only person left actively leaving comments on the page. Hello? I've been literally asking the mailman every day. Is it here? Is it here? He just looks at me with a sad face. Please send my product soon. Thank you. Oh, Michael. That brings us all the way to this year, 2021. One week ago. Day 2,582, the search goes on. I want to make Michael Superbacker a real working air umbrella. And I'm not the only one who's invested in Michael's journey. Michael is a man of focus, a force of nature so powerful not even the air umbrella could stop him. Charles White is the only person who I'd call a Michael Superbacker expert. Hello? Hey. Hey, Charlie, thank you for taking the call. We're d doing this interview in a van. That sounds fitting for something like the air umbrella, really. <laughs> what is it about Michael Superbacker that is like so interesting to you? He's like an actual real world anime character who never gives up. I like to imagine him as just this mysterious air umbrella spirit of vengeance. The reason I'm calling you is I want to try and make Michael Superbacker a real working air umbrella. That's so funny cool <laughs> i think it's like that last piece of his identity like once he gets it he will be whole do you have any means of contacting him directly no no i've never i've never talked to him i think in one of his comments he had like his email i sent michael an email and i messaged him on youtube and i tweeted at him over a period of two months with no response it's time to get serious. The Michael Superbacker YouTube channel has zero videos, but it does have featured channels. These are channels that Michael likes so much that he's chosen to promote them. And his number one is a 22 year old vlogger named Audrey Ember. He's been commenting on my channel for the past two years, so I did recognize his logo. Is he talking about he's... the air umbrella on your channel? No, I don't even know what that is. He said he got a thousand subscribers without posting a video. You think he was like trying to impress you? Maybe the like, I got a thousand subscribers without posting is kind of a flex. He was the first comment on one of your videos. First, Happy New Year, Audrey. Like he was the... I don't know, maybe he's dedicated. <laughs> Michael Superbacker won't reply to me, but he will reply to Audrey. Would you be willing to follow him back on Twitter for me so that you can send him a DM? Sure. Why not? <laughs> On October 4th, Audrey DM'd Michael Superbacker this message, and as of the publish of this video, he has yet to respond. <sighs> Michael Superbacker, wherever you are, whoever you are, I will hunt you, I will find you, and I will give you an air umbrella. We're gonna crowdsource this. If you know someone who might know someone, who might know someone, who might know who Michael Superbacker is, show him this video. And Michael, when you see this, leave a comment right here on this video so we can all confirm and I'll finally send you your air umbrella.
This is the only footage that exists of the Air Umbrella in action. It's not quite enough to reverse engineer it, but the campaign gives us some other good hints. Model C, the most powerful version of the Umbrella, is advertised as 80 centimeters long with a 14.8 volt battery that runs a 30 watt motor and impeller. Using these specs, I've commissioned what is probably the closest thing in the world to what the Kickstarter promised to deliver. Can we try it out? Yes, absolutely, we can try it out. <laughs> Simone is gonna be a rain cloud, and I'm gonna be a man from the future with his future umbrella. Rain on me! <laughs> Keep going, it might work! Oh no, I can't believe it didn't work. It really didn't do shit. It is kind of suspicious that the frame cuts off at the bottom of the umbrella. It could literally be hooked up to like a jet engine, we wouldn't see it. I was afraid that this was the end, but that's when Simone came up with a brilliant idea that was really obvious in hindsight. <laughs> that's much better. Let's see how well this works. Oh! That's, oh, that's like legitimately like the force field that the Kickstarter claimed would be for. Yeah. If that air umbrella was the size of a leaf blower. I mean, we can mount that. So I bought the most powerful electric leaf blower that money can buy. My eyelids were just flapping and slapping my eyeballs. That's crazy. Yeah, this is a really good leaf blower. So we're just turning it this way and putting a diffuser on the top. We're gonna see okay. if we can make an air umbrella. That's, pr that's pretty powerful. If this doesn't do it, nothing's gonna do it. <laughs> Nat Roman modeled me a giant version of the Air Umbrella head, and she was extremely confident in her work. I think it's going to do jack shit. Have you actually tried this yet? You know, I live in this place where it never rains. <laughs> <laughs> and she's right. Los Angeles is pretty much in the desert. So if I'm gonna test this thing, I'm gonna need to get creative by stealing someone else's idea. That looks great. I know. This is, it's so funny. Like uh, this is literally just a garden hose and it like totally looks professional. <laughs> Umbrella 2.0. We're gonna try the hose on the mist setting first because this is about like as light as it gets. It's like a gentle drizzle. I'm just gonna back into it. I think I have to angle it this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, ah! Dude, that works really well. Yeah. Ooh! Yeah. It goes sideways. It like does. it comes down, it goes sideways. It's mist. It, it works with mist. It does work with mist. Let's move it to the shower setting. Same thing as before, but this mm -hmm. is like, this is kind of legit rain. Also, the air umbrella is getting kind of wet, so I'm not sure how the lithium batteries go. <laughs> A non-waterproof <laughs> umbrella, uh, that's yeah, well, you know. great. Three, two, one. Oh, it's kind of working. Let's go. Are you getting? I'm dry. Really? I'm, I am dry. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, okay, good. That's crazy. Okay, very good. Okay. He's dude, dry. Look at that. You're it's dry. Look yeah. At, dude, look at my shirt. That's crazy. That's insane, dude. Wow. I can't really hear out of this ear, but uh, <laughs> totally worth it. Dude! Definitely pushing it out of the way, yeah. That's crazy. Yep. It's like making a perfect oh, it's got like a yep. hole. It's like a me-shaped hole. It's like just <laughs> enough. <laughs> this is for you, Michael. Yes. <laughs> just when I thought things couldn't get any better, God himself. Got involved. In case you didn't know it, it is wet outside. We're LA. We're always unprepared yeah. for the rain. Come on. I don't. I don't own an umbrella because it's rare. Honestly, it looks like a tuba. <laughs> this is the future of umbrellas. It's not a tuba. It's for you, Michael. I think, I think this is working. And then the rain turns back on. It passed the final test. Real rain. Dude, that is until the rain's picking up. I'm getting drenched, so go. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> it's, not, it's not working anymore. Ah. I need a raise. Right, I need a freaking raise. Here, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. It's bad. It's terrible. It is a really bad umbrella. But if you like gave me the option of this or nothing. If you are Michael Superbacker and you would like the world's only actual working air umbrella, then leave a comment on this video. Hey, you're buying me lunch, right? Yeah, I'll, I'll get you full. You want full? Let's yeah. Just... What's that? Is that you getting a real umbrella? Yeah, I'm just gonna use... <laughs>
I want to thank Bluehost for sponsoring this part of the video. If you didn't know, Bluehost is one of the largest website hosting providers and it already powers millions of websites. They've got this web builder that's really easy to use. You can toggle between WordPress core or the Bluehost builder. I personally don't know how to use WordPress, so I'm gonna use their builder to make a website in like 30 seconds. I'm gonna say the website is about technology. Oh yeah, that looks good. We're gonna continue. And uh, the name of the site, let's say good, uh, pretty, oh, pr pretty website, web, website, uh, because it is a good and pretty website. And the cover image, I love it. We're gonna upload a logo. I don't really have the logo, but we're gonna go with just Oswald text that looks very professional. I love the dark style, the yellow and black, fantastic navigation style. Let's go with uh, this, I like it more centered. We're gonna continue, uh, contact info. I'm gonna keep that private. And finish, see that's the quick start template. It's really fast to get started. And if I wanna change the appearance, they've got this drag and drop editor of what if I want this up here, the welcome is up top now. It's super easy, barely an inconvenience. Start building a website with Bluehost today. Use the link in my description to get more than 65% off. And thank you again to Bluehost for sponsoring this part of the video.